for a Christian church to be welcoming for the transgender community bill, I find one of the more important things. Nothing against the Unitarian mm -hmm. Church, but there's this belief, especially in the South, that am I going to go to hell and it doesn't matter my good deeds simply because I'm transgender. And that's because of the Bible mm -hmm. and my family using that as a weapon. Your church is not like that. As you know, I grew up in the South. Mm -hmm. So even though I grew up in the Episcopal Church, uh, in the South, it, everything had a Southern Baptist ethos to it. Yes. So I understand that little voice in the head that when we do something wrong can be very cruel and mean and, and, and ugly. Mm -hmm. um, I'm aware of that and I'm also aware how easy it is you can prove anything in Scripture and just pull any verse out you want. So what we do, uh, I think, in the Episcopal Church and what I do and what we do at All Saints is we don't focus on concepts to begin with, we focus on the man, Jesus. And for us, Jesus is our description, our image of God. So if you can imagine, uh, if, if you look at Scripture and you see Jesus welcoming all sorts of people, uh, talking about, uh, there's a passage where he talks about intersex people uh, and embraces and loves, then our next move is to say, well, this is the heart of God. This is how God is. And that in Scripture there's a trajectory. Sure, you can find some verses in Leviticus or Deuteronomy. They're isolated, but you can find them. But then you go to Isaiah 56 and there's a welcoming verse for all sorts of people. And then you get to Jesus and, and that trajectory is going, revealing the heart of God for all God's people. And, and you see that in Luke and Paul. And so that to me uh, really opens up life. And so for us, the gospel is not about us climbing some ladder of perfection up to God. The good news is God in Christ coming down that ladder to us who have fallen off the ladder and are broken and busted up and hurting and filled with all sorts of self-hate and guilt. And we, we're all down there and that's at the foot of the cross. So it's about Jesus coming down, God coming down and Jesus to us. And therefore, that's what we do. That's our call is to be that, let him living in us do that in the world. Okay. We're broken, we want to share what the love of God in Christ has done for us.